chickens, I hatch uh, the old and I sell fresh eggs as well. Well, we hatch the old grillers, the old layers, and we also sell slaughtered and table farm, table farm fresh table eggs. Um, the project started back in 2019, so it was officially registered in 2019, but it has history. Uh, that was started by my mother back then. Mm -hmm. So informally, it's been a couple of years, but formally it's been from 2019. Where I grew up, there's little resources, and people are not really, don't have really access to a lot of things. So growing up, I saw my mother raising chickens. So there was a little bit of a gap when it came to supplying chicks. We are removed from, and the community that I'm in is not really developed. So I saw that there was a need for food, so to say. <laughs> I saw there was a need for youth employment, and uh, a lot of people really needed resources that were not near them. So that gap, I needed, well, I felt the need to fill it. She bought the first 100 chicks for me. She also bought me three. And, uh, I failed first. <laughs> uh, well, the first time around, I didn't know how to properly manage the chickens because there was a lot of medication that the chicks needed to get. I was late on giving the medication, so the first three tries, I failed. On the fourth one, that's where the business kind of picked up, and I saved money for buying my first incubator because my passion was hatching chicks. So when that happened, uh, it's been upscaling from then to now. I read a lot. Oh, well, I, first time around, I went through YouTube videos about hatching. The first time around, I watched a couple of videos. After my first unsuccessful try, I watched a couple of videos, uh, hatched where I could, read a couple of books as well, and uh, that worked. So the second time around, I had uh, some contamination inside the pen. So I went and did a little bit of research from other people that were in the same business. But people from my community didn't know how to actually solve the problem that I had. So I had to do my own research and then figure out how I could solve all of those problems for myself. So mostly it's been myself, the internet and people around me. I can't say it's unique. I'm trying to compliment everyone who's around me. Mostly the informal uh, business traders around me. I can't say it's really unique and I can't say it stands out. What I'm trying to do is bring in the whole community so that we find a structure that could best suit everyone around us. So, uh, the uniqueness in it is trying to find a balance between informal and formal traders. 